Oh, whoops. Uh, what is whoops? Uh, nothing important. That doesn't make me feel better, that makes me feel worse. Oh, uh, uh, accident, but it's alright. Captain's Lock, CUS Interponk. We're on board the Wasted Wing, and we've found where the survivors are holed up. Now we just have to eliminate the source of the outbreak, which I seem to recall was a big problem in the previous timeline. Okay, activate the lift. Wow, Smith's got a bit of a head start on this lift on my screen. Yeah. Same. Oh, am I hovering in the air? Yes. Yeah, like substantially. You reach the top huh. of the lift shaft about two minutes before the rest of us. Uh -huh. Okay, so we've got friendlies. Oh, we've got friendlies and Mike's just, uh... eliminating them already. What? Okay, so Dr. Vilvard can explain the strange things we've seen. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, so the research specimen's from a neighbouring galaxy. That, where the uh, entire galaxy like has been crystallised. I hope that doesn't happen to our galaxy. Crikey. Entire sectors of space filled with asteroids of crystalline material. Even the planetary surfaces. Bim. Uh, okay, so... Oh, this is quite a long wall of text. This Vilvard chap can talk. Yeah, like, he's... He, it's like in an opera when somebody, like, with their dying breath, like, sings a massive thing. Mm -hmm. Um, Rashi's so yeah, the crystals got out of the containment chamber. Okay, so have we talked to... Yeah, this guy doesn't say anything. Talks about crystals erupting out of somebody. Talk to this robot, he doesn't say anything either. Okay, so he wants us to save the whole galaxy by killing the research specimen in his lab. Oh, whoops. Uh, what is whoops? Uh, nothing important. That doesn't make me feel better, that makes me feel worse. Oh, uh, I... Uh, accident, but it's alright. Oh, well, you, you can have a few uh, minutes to go some, change your pants if you need there's to. A bunch of, there's a bunch of spare ammo here oh, if well. anyone needs some ammo. Well, I'm going to yellow That's alert because uh, Smith's had an accident. What? What are you talking about? Well, if you've had I an accident, you definitely need a yellow alert. Okay. Um... Okay, let's check out the administration wing. This way? I think this is where we find the security doors, apart from anything else. Well... Oh, okay, this like is where medicine friends. is. Yeah, there, there's a key card somewhere through here that for the uh, main boss, for the boss room. Uh, oh, I've picked up the uh, stuff. I picked up some stuff as well. Oh, fuck. <laughs> we are not alert today. Keep your wits about <laughs> you. Oh, it's, uh... oh. RCX is not very alert. Popped out right behind him. What? I was shooting at it. It was behind you. Oh, well, there was one in front. Uh, yeah, so this, this, so this is the door that requires the thing, but we don't have the... Oh, beam, mm -hmm. rifle, beam rifle plus two, I'll have that. <laughs> yeah. So I think we just go kill the boss. Okay, uh, okay. If we want a prerequisite. Go, oh, go, go, go and heal the guy. Go and heal the guy first, and then go oh, yeah, kill the boss. Medicine. Right. 
And bear in mind that we should all be ready be with us. and fully healed before we go into that room, because as soon as we go into that room, the timer starts. Good initiative, Mike. But don't, so yeah, don't oh, run ahead. <laughs> I talked to the guy and gave him the medicine back, which was quite clever, really, because I didn't have the medicine. Yeah, yeah. But I guess we do have these like yeah. micro transporters that let us send equipment to each other from any distance away. So I mean, it makes sense. Yeah. I can just yeah. summon the medicine. Yeah. Now be ready. Have your guns up. Yeah. Be ready. Don't go in until everyone's ready. Say your phases <laughs> to frag. We're roasting this creature. Okay. Right. Just wait. Hang RCX. on a sec. Okay. Go. Go. Okay. Are you ready? Okay, ready? Breach. Breach. Cutscene! Yep. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, drop down and find cover. I think we need to ow, just like ow. I'm, keep I'm running. Really not doing the cover thing very well. Oh man, I forgot how what long this thing takes to reload. Uh, I'm better eat my biscuits. Yeah, because you've got the other healing going, can you heal me? Uh, one sec. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's not really what I want. To do. Where are you? I'm by the door where we came in. It's also a good idea, I think, if we all split up, because then it can't. Yep, I'm over here now. Hey, okay, hold still. Go. Yeah. Yeah, sorry. Um, hold oh, still quite oh, hard when you're the thing directly behind That's why I'm in that's cover. trying to kill me. Yeah. Um, well, there was a... There was um, a uh, it was hit me with some kind of... It's hit me with some kind of thing. Uh, Where are you? Uh, it, it, it spawns zombies. It's alright. Yeah. Ah. I'm getting very zombied here. Um, oh, fuck. I need to find somewhere safe to go and hide. Ah. Well, we're doing a lot better this time. <laughs> Revitalise myself by doing some drugs. Oh no! Uh, reload. Where is it? It's there. I think it's lining up on me now. Yeah, it's on me now. Or oh, maybe not. Just okay. going to find uh, cover. Ow. Oh, I fell down a hole. Okay, but we're doing really well. We've got seven minutes left, and it's like got hardly any health left. That did me a lot of damage. Those zombies are actually quite powerful. And oh, there's another one on you as well, because you're you know focusing on the big one. Smith, you need to get to cover. Uh, I can heal you if you get to me by the door. Uh, where are you? I'm just coming, but I'll be I'll be arriving by the doorway in a moment. 
Okay, I'm gonna head over to you as well. Oh, oh I'm mind. dead. Sorry. There was another zombie. I thought I got them. Okay, I'm. Um, uh, can you uh, how is it doing? Badly. How are we doing? Okay. Uh, zombie uh, on RTX. Can, can you, uh, can okay, you heal down. me? Uh, yeah. Down. Yeah. No. Oh, shit. Before I get killed. Uh, fuck. Well, I was healing you, and now you're here. I can't see you. Yeah. Uh, and there's oh, a zombie. Uh, try and keep running, moving from cover to cover around the thing it's in. Around the big circular room. Yeah. What I was doing. I can't see you anymore, right. Mike. Yeah, sorry, I'm. It's right like, on top I've lost of the half my health trying to heal you because you keep hiding. Sorry. Oh, okay. Fuck. Where am I going? I'm going. To... Wait. Okay, I'm. Oh, I'm here. Yep. Oh shit, it's coming at me. I'm gonna have to move because it's about to go start shooting us otherwise. Right, you can come back a bit. Alright, overheated. Shoot the zombie. Shoot the thing. I'm coming as fast as I can. I can't heal you that fast, Mike. <laughs> oh. Mike's just meat shielding it up. Nearly down. Oh shit, I need to reload again. What the hell? Oh, zombie. <laughs> zombie on you, Mike. Yeah, I can see it. Uh, my gun's not working. If you can lead it back towards me, I can help you. I got it, I got it. Use your revitalizing strange, Mike. Yeah. Oh, it's looking right at me. This isn't going to end well. Alright, should be dead anyway. Oh man, get me. I've damaged myself. Come on, it's only got 1100 health left. This is amazing. Yeah, I think we're, I think we're alright. Oh, yes! Got it. Does it work? I was like, I, I just saw it, it was shooting at me, I'm like, I don't care, I'm gonna kill it. <laughs> That's the attitude. Oh, we ended up back on what the thing. Oh, okay. Okay, so evidently that other one was not in the thing. No, so we didn't get it. That's a shame. Yeah. Oh. Oh, we're warping away. What? Oh. What? What happened? Uh, we finished the mission and it immediately... And it warped um, us out. Warped us out. Oh, well. Evidently it wasn't in that room then. Ah. So you command center thanks us for our service and asks us to report back. Yeah. yeah. To, well, um, yeah, we... Command center. I don't know where so that. What happened? Did we did we miss out on getting one of the keycards? Yeah, we did. We could We didn't, obviously oh. it was somewhere and we didn't find it. Lame. Oh, we well. didn't find it last time either. Okay, everybody way. go and heal up while we're in warp. Oh. oh okay, everybody go and heal up <laughs> now. We've dropped out of warp. Only one biscuit effect can be active at a time. When you eat a biscuit, be mindful of another flavor. What kind of tooltip is that? Just like real life. <laughs> yeah. Always be fine. Definitely uh, completely accurate that you can't get extra strength and extra shielding from eating biscuits at the same time. <laughs> that is technically correct. Okay, so we need to go over to some officer whose name begins with D. Uh, yeah, I know where they'll be. Um, oh, so uh, one of the dispatch officers here in um, CU Command is uh, grateful because her sister is one of the scientists we rescued from the research bank. Oh. Okay, good. Just here to yeah. help, ma'am. You mentioned us getting like a special reward or something. Did we get any money? Or what? Uh what have you done, RCX? We got that like the massive <laughs> hole in the middle. Oh, uh, did you fall down? Like... <laughs> yeah, I did that first time. So the other person I've spoken to on this desk says Um they're opening jobs. Oh, well, they just sent me jobs, generally. Um, well, that's good. We can definitely so do with more jobs. So, there's a low risk. Oh, so no, we're we new to her, so she's going to give us a low risk thing. Yeah, no, we don't want that. Okay, so I've reported to Commander Hatton. 
Like, I'm a captain. Shouldn't okay. Commander Hatham be, like, reporting to me? Uh, presumably, Command, it's different ranking mm. orders, I guess. Who can say? Um, so, come if you come down to where I am, there's somebody who's giving a, who's offering us a mission. Or can I just can finish I just off this mission regardless? first? Okay. So, Commander okay. Hatham says we did excellent work, and they got the last survivors out safely. And they were, are all going to make a full recovery, including Dr. Vilvard. Thanks to the medicine. Uh, and Dr. Vilvard is immensely Not capable grateful of a recovery. Uh, but Commander Hatham has one more matter to bring to our attention. Okay. About the lost colony. Title drop, title drop. Is it near a pulsar? Um, it is a hope that a crew of officers such as us can represent the CU in the race to find the last colony, and she's giving us a data fragment. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Giving us a lot of money as awesome well. Awesome shields and range. Yeah. And yeah, a lot of money. Nice. It is going to a planet called Muva 7, finding some medical supplies that have been nicked outlaws and taken there. Oh, people stealing um, supplies? Shocking. I know. And but from the colonial crew union, do such a thing. Um, so she does say it's a low risk thing because as far as she's concerned, she's never met us before, so we're news. Okay, yeah. Fair. But, you know, whatever. Um, so it's, it's a good chance these medical supplies are being stored in an old terraforming station at that location. We need They need us to go there, investigate what we can, and bring them back. I mean... Yeah, do it. May as well? Yep. Okay. Let's take that mission. Ah, uh ah. -huh. Oh, okay, so we've got another offer of a mission here. Um, uh -huh. from a guy in the hydroponics lab. Oh, or a woman. I mean, Kim could be a boy's name or a girl's name, but I think she seems to have a bust. So I'm going to go with woman on this one. Uh -huh. Um, uh, a friend of hers was working with a research team on a planet and uh, she hasn't heard from them for a few weeks and is concerned that something went wrong so we can go and find them as well sounds like okay. a mission of mercy yeah yeah so there's a heavy beam pistol plus three here and i don't have one of those at the moment but then it does take ammo plus three i would snap that up yeah yeah like where are you mike if i you still don't, don't understand it, the layout of this there's two of them actually if, if we can get two of them Mm, I'm, I'm liking my pistols, though. I'll stick with my pistol, I think. Okay, does anyone else want a heavy beam pistol plus three? Uh, right. Yes, please. Okay. Uh, I think that's definitely a good uh, investment. There were, there, were, there were only two there, so... Um, okay. Unless I can trade. I'm perfectly relaxed about people just, like, jetpacking around inside their station and uh, standing on bits that clearly aren't supposed to be stood on. Yeah... Yeah. Patrol bots just like, do 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 do, not interested. Right. Uh, okay, I'm bored now. Can I fly the ship somewhere? Uh, no. uh well, first I might May just, I fly uh... the ship somewhere, in case you're going to be like that. <laughs> yeah, I, try, I, I tried putting my hands in the optimize, optimizer, but it didn't let me. Yeah. Oh, I'm, I think, were you, on the, were you on the stream? I tried to put my hands in my locker, and it wouldn't let me. I was very disappointed by it. Okay. Uh... It's really striking, the difference between different bits of the graphic like some of it's really beautiful and then some of it's just like lumpy polygon polygons everywhere it's early access i mean i'm i'm lining up on the jump gate oh Ooh, so there's we... a bounty hunter after us that's what that thing was before oh okay They're in the so is that somebody across. that may or may not be at a planet when we jump out of it uh well maybe at a system when we jump out of it yeah yeah, yeah. So where are these missions that we've just got ah uh, okay we could just go and kill the bounty hunter. Oh, there's one over there. We don't know who or where they are. Uh, yes, we do. Look at the map. Oh, do we? Hmm. Um, well, do, we know, a do we know what their ship is like? Because look, we might need no, to get a bit don't. stronger before we do that. Well, they're going to we catch don't. us up sooner or later but they're anyway. they're going to catch us anyway, so... Uh, let's go through the warp gate to 329. Uh, oh yeah, I need to talk to the warp gate. Okay, I haven't got our signs up, sorry. Uh, I'm sure who was sent a bounty hunter at us, but anyway. I mean... I think it was Rev. 
it could be the pirates. They do hate yeah, us quite a bit. They don't like this. And they they walk get spinning around now. Yep. Oh. We want to go it? through it. Yes, but it's now facing in a different direction. Yes, because it's facing the way we want to go. Bah. We had this in the very first episode. Yes, but I'd forgotten about it. Right, well, while I was, you're I was quite happily that, getting... I'm going to go and refresh my beer. I'm going to kill you. <laughs> F5. Beer. Oh, we look very lined up now. This is beautiful. Funk. Wait, what? Chaos level has increased. Oh, what is the chaos level? Uh, At two. Okay, so we've had a message from CU Command. They want us to determine the cause of failure in an abandoned, intrepid class starship. So the USS Centuria was an exploratory colonial union vessel. Before transmission ceased, the crew reported they investigated the planet's surface and underwent an exosuit breach. Uh, 32 hours later, they lost contact with them. Also, have you noticed how you jumped through the gate backwards and now all the stars are traveling backwards? Mm, stars are traveling the right direction. Okay, we've dropped out. Oh, we've got so many missions now, I don't even know which one's which. Uh, so let's investigate the ship first. Which is 1747. Uh, one jump. Okay. I just oh, want to take a moment to say well done there. to the crew for taking what was a very challenging mission that we yeah. might have failed in a different timeline. I don't quite remember. <laughs> I mean, you know, hypotheticals are, are we all very well, but the fact is that uh, the fact Come is that we passed the mission. Yes, and yeah, but yes, that the, that one that was simpler than I'd expected it would have been after the last what? attempt. After the last attempt. <laughs> mm. Not spending like an hour trying to get through the jumpy puzzle definitely made that easier. Yes. It didn't. Except psychologically. I was genuinely really tense in that jumpy bit because I didn't want to screw it up again. Will the pilot get over his fear of screwing up? What will the crew find at the Centurio? What was the cause of its sudden radio silence? And does Mike have enough guns to deal with it? Will the captain run out of beer? Find out in the next thrilling episode.